Hello everyone, welcome back. As always, today I'm gonna show four more transitions and you can use them on your Final Cut Pro for your editing and you can download them from the Google Drive, there are four of them. But before the start of today's tutorial and video, please remember to just to subscribe and like this video. Thank you very much, your motivation really keeps me going. And also, please remember just to comment in the comment section to tell me what you want to see for the next plugin and let's move on to the installation basically after you've already downloaded the file the automate file lc distort from the google drive and unzip if you need to and once you open you can see that there are four transitions and just copy the entire folder lc distort and just go to go home movies motion templates and just put it in this folder in this transitions folder and that's all you need to do restart your Final Cut Pro go to your transitions tab you can find LC distort and there are actually only four of them this time but I think they're still very useful for you and let's move on to the application part so basically from the intro video you can see that there are actually four of them first one it's very obvious it's kind of like a luma fade plus distortion yep it's like a those rainy kind of effect so maybe for the application part i'm just gonna use it on another video so this is actually splash yep as you can see that the entire you know frame the entire object is being dragged down and bring down to the bottom and revealing the next frame or next clip and maybe try another one the, the original distort so this is like those water droplet and hit it in the middle of the frame and bring it out you can lengthen the transition obviously but for overall result to be the best I would just suggest not to lengthen to be a very long one yep but obviously if you want to have those very very dramatic effect you can always just you know lengthen it to a very long period of time and remember just go to modify and render selection of this transition so the transition can appear very smoothly on your preview window play Yep, it's something like that. It's going to be quite a long winded one. Next step is the pixel. So, obviously, I've already rendered it out and put in between clips. And this one actually takes quite a while for you to actually render the entire thing out. So, please be patient when you're rendering this transition. Render the transition, just hit play. It's quite a quick one, but it's kind of a cool one. And I really love this you know, effect. And last but not least, this one is actually the wave transition, but it's kind of a standard one. So this is like a twist and a shake plus wave transition. So yep, it's kind of cool. It's kind of a little bit of distortion over there, not very big, but just consider it as a distort. And that's pretty much about it for today's free plugin and motion templates giveaway. And once again, please remember to subscribe to this channel and like this video. And just leave me a comment to tell me what you want to see for the next video. Thanks a lot and bye bye.